Hello guys, so let's play a little with the uh, Yuri's build from uh, of Blender with some modifiers, etc, etc. So as you can see, first I will clean the normals with the new uh, weighted normal modifier. And as you can see, the result is way better. So for me, we work in uh, non-destructible non uh, workflow. This is perfect. I can have something really, really, really nice with modifiers, etc, etc. Everything is editable, of course like that if i uh, edit this one for example i can play with this bevel like that uh, select the other uh, the other one edit everything i can move this here like that etc everything is editable i can hide everything up up, up shift q like that so uh, I will just select this to update. I can call another uh, boolean, of course. I, I will switch between a different boolean, like that. And I can edit this one too, with my bevel. Something like that, if I want something really, uh, really nice like that. And if I select the other, to have something like that. Okay. So, I will uh, select this one and hide everything. As you can see, this is pretty nice. Uh, you can now use the uh, triangulate this one. And uh, to triangulate only on and gone, you will add uh, N here on the name. And you will uh, reload it. And as you can see, the triangulate is only on the... Uh, on the end bones. So this is really nice and you can of course continue to edit your model if you want. As you can see that will uh, make uh, it, uh, that will edit it directly on the fly and this is really useful. So uh, at this time if you want you can uh, add a subdivision surface like this. Uh, this is not clean but you don't care. The important part is to have something really 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 clean as you can see here. You will duplicate it, shift D, Hoopla. échappe, I will go here, I will make Alt C mesh from uh, converted to mesh, that will apply everything, and as you can see, this is my result. So, if I do this, I have this result. You can directly uh, use this to uh, print it, or if you want, you can uh, add a mesh, like this, you can select this move, Add an octree to 8. And that's it. You can activate this smooth shading. Okay. And now you have uh, something like this. The result is pretty clean. For um, printing, that should be enough. No need. Uh, to. And uh, if you want, you can, uh, on the previous version, uh, edit everything, add as many subdivisions you want, uh, change the, uh, the bevels, etc., etc. And on this one, you can add a corrective smooth if you want to smooth it a little. Like that. Let's check without. We don't really see the, uh, the difference. So you can play with the options, uh, length weight, etc, etc. On this move, uh, the factor, the repeat, etc, etc. So factor to one. Repeat to ten. I should have something, but uh, the previous version uh, was already uh, pretty smooth, so we don't see the, uh, the result here. But the final result is a mesh that will be really nice uh, for uh, sculpting, etc, etc. And of course, you can uh, use it directly if you want, like that. Uh, for rendering, I will need just to activate my GPU, like that. And like that. So I will just activate, up, add it a little shader. Wait a little because I have only one card on this PC. And that's it. Pretty, pretty, pretty nice. I will just edit with metallic part. Something like that. 
So as you can see, the result is pretty nice, and this is uh, this is pretty good. So I really, really, really like the new uh, weighted normal. It's uh, it's perfect to work on a non destructive workflow to don't to not have uh, any. Uh, uh, normal issues, etc., etc. The triangulate on only end guns is really, really, really nice. I hope Blender Dev will add it too. That can be, uh, I, honestly, personally, I want it. Uh, as you can see here, this is not good because uh, the, the viewport resolution is in automatic. I will put to one and I should have something better right now. Just have to wait a little. As you can see the difference. On the film, you can make it transparent. On the sampling, uh, you can press uh, 300, and uh, you will see the result. So this is uh, this is a, um, a good workflow, I think, uh, for a good result. And this is pretty nice. You can do whatever you want. You can keep it uh, everything. Yeah, you, know, you can keep everything uh, full non-destructible. And uh, for me, this is uh, this is perfect because uh, before uh, validating uh, an object, uh, I can edit it, etc., etc. So this is uh, this is really nice. So let's hope Dev will add uh, all these uh, modifiers. And uh, I haven't showed you uh, some other uh, modifiers, but uh, on the uh, curve, uh, this place on the curve, uh, this is nice. You can add a rope texture to make a rope, uh, etc., etc. So this is pretty, 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 pretty nice.